Okay, we have here today another integral from the UNSW integration B2020. This one's problem 16. We have the integral from one to infinity of one over x times x squared plus one dx. Okay, now in most cases, I don't really have a preference of which method to use. I kind of, sometimes I do the harder method, sometimes I do the easier method. Sometimes I'll do the shorter method, sometimes I'll do the longer method. Sometimes I'll just do a method because I think it's interesting. And I usually won't say a method is better or worse because it just depends on the situation, your preference, what you're trying to accomplish. But in this one case, I think I found the best method. So you can let me know in the comments if you have a better method or a worse method or a different method. But let's just go ahead with the best method and we'll see how it goes. Okay, so for my first step I'm going to do is we're going to take this and just factor this piece. But I'm going to factor an x squared out of this and write this as x squared times 1 plus 1 over x squared. Now rewriting this, multiplying x times x squared, we're gonna have x cubed in the denominator, and then this is gonna be one plus, one over x squared, I'm gonna write this as x to the minus two with the dx in the numerator. But I can just take my x cubed and bring that into the numerator. So I'm gonna write that in the numerator as x to the minus three dx over one plus x to the minus two. So then from here, what we'll do is a u substitution. I'm gonna make the u the whole denominator. So I'll say u is just gonna be one plus x to the minus two I'll take my derivative, then for du, we're gonna have, this is just gonna become with power rule, minus two x to the minus three dx. But then I can just create this du in the numerator if I just multiply by minus two, and then multiply by minus one half here, so we're just multiplying by one. And now let's just go ahead with the substitution. So I'm gonna have minus a half out front, plugging infinity in here. Well, one over infinity, that part of it's gonna be zero, so this is actually just going to one for the upper bound. Then plugging a one over here, we're gonna end up with one plus one or just two. Then the numerator becomes du and the denominator becomes just u. Then before I integrate, I'm just gonna take this minus sign I can use it to flip my bound. So we'll just remove this and we'll flip this so then we have two as the upper bound and one as the lower bound. Then we'll just go ahead and integrate. We're gonna have one half in front. This is gonna become natural log absolute value of u. We just need to evaluate it from one to two. Evaluating this, we're gonna have one half natural log of two, then evaluating at one, we have natural log of one, but that's just gonna be zero. And I think what I'll do is take this one half into the exponent, and so I can write this for my final solution as just natural log square root of two. And that's it. Okay, so it went pretty quick with the u substitution. Thanks everyone for watching, have a good day.